Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here, and welcome back to more Let's Play New Super Mario Bros. Wii. I did take one week break to, you know, get away from this game for a little bit because... We are getting ready to do a very, 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 very difficult world. This is World 9. As I've said before, this world is kind of like the special zone was in Super Mario World. I mean, to some people it might not be that hard, but, you know, I mean, they are... It, these levels are more difficult than the rest of the levels in the game, so you have to give them at least, you know, that. And, uh, we gotta do all eight of these. Not only do we have to beat the levels, we also have to collect the three star coins in each level as well. Again, I guess we don't have to, but... Because I always do perfectionist runs, I always have to, so... Here we go, World 9-1. And hooray, I actually start out with the uh, propeller suit, because I uh, saved it when I fought Bowser. I didn't lose it like an idiot. But I'm probably going to lose it to a Goomba here in a second, so... I mean, I can't be giving myself that much extra credit here, but we'll see what happens. So yeah, here we are, World 9. Um, can't believe we're already here. As I said before, this game kind of just like flew by. This game didn't take as long as I thought it would, but... Whatever, we're here now, and we've already done the rest of the game, so we might as well do this part of the game too. And look, here's our first star coin of World 9. Hopefully we don't lose it. Um, speaking of losing star coins, um... This world, I believe, has no midway points in any of the levels, so if you die in the possession of any star coins, you have to pretty much go back to the beginning of the level and collect them again. This is very, very annoying for some star coins that will basically try to kill you in so many ways. Uh, so far I'm not doing too bad though, but this level's not over yet. Oh goody, we have piranha plants. Fireball spinning piranha plants. You know, I have to admit, we don't see very many fireball spinning plants in, like, I guess the 3D uh, Mario games. I mean, you sometimes do, but not too often. Is this a... No, that's not. But I don't know. Yeah, they kind of got rid of those, like, when they got to, um... I don't think they were even in Super Mario World, now that I think about it. Yeah, they weren't. They only had the uh, jumping piranha plants. So yeah, they got rid of the... Uh... Wait, is, it the end of... is this the end of the level? Yes, it is. Okay, so I'm going to get a star coin. Okay, looks like I'm going to be looking for that while I'm here. But yeah, you don't really... They kind of got rid of the uh, fireball spinning piranha plants, although I might not be thinking of every single instance. I do have a very forgetful nature, as you guys probably know. Okay, let's see if I can... I'm surprised I didn't get hit by that, honestly. Okay, I have no idea where this last star coin could be. I'm almost tempted to just, you know, like, fall down in random pits until I find, like, a pipe or something. But that would be very stupid, and I really don't want to do that. Ah! Almost lost it. I almost lost it. Okay, is it down here? I have a feeling it might be down here. Because there's like... Actually, I think it is. Let me make sure. No, it's not. Okay. I'm glad I had the propeller mushroom with me then. Because I apparently knew nothing about that. Um... Okay, wow, I do not know where to look for this last star coin. Um, I've been pretty much everywhere. I checked that pipe, I remember that, so I'm not going to check that again. Is it in one of these pipes? It actually might be, I don't know. Aw, oh, dang it. Stupid piranha plant. Well, there goes my propeller mushroom, which sucks. Okay. Let me check again. Okay, nope, not there. Is it down there? I have a feeling it's down somewhere, but I don't want to be an idiot and check a random pit or something. Whatever, I'll finish the level and I'll come back later and find it. 
That's probably what I'll do. If there's like one star coin where I can't remember where it is, I'll just like go ahead and complete the level and then I'll come back off screen or something. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to go ahead and move on to 9-2. Um, I honestly don't remember what the majority of these levels are like. I know a few of them. Uh, specifically 9-4 and 9-7. But I don't know too much about the rest of the levels, honestly. I think a 9-5 is like a snow level. Or ice level. Whatever you want to call it. Uh, 9-6 is a fire level. Kind of like the levels we saw in uh, World 8. And, um... Oh yeah, 9-8 is the uh, bouncy level. We'll see all these levels later. I'm not going to try to spoil them all, but... Okay, now I think I remember what all the levels are now. This is like the only level that I kind of forgot existed. That's right. I forgot about you, you stupid fish. I forgot you for a very good reason, though, because I hate you. And I almost got hit by you right there. Hooray for one-ups, and hooray for not having a hat anymore, which, again, I've said this over and over again, but... The reason why Mario doesn't have a hat is because he has 99 lives. I seem to get that question in every single video, it seems, which... I can understand. I mean, not everyone's gonna watch every single video of the project, but... Still. That is why Mario does not have a hat! And that is why you're not gonna eat me, you stupid fish. Oh, jeez. <laughs> okay, wow. Uh, I, have, I tried to fire an ice uh, an ice bullet at him, and then he just tried to chase me there for a minute. Okay, but so far I'm not actually doing that bad, I have to say. I'm not doing amazing or anything, but... I haven't died yet, but that'll probably change here in a little bit. I don't have very much confidence in my abilities, if you guys haven't been able to tell yet. Which a lot of people say that I shouldn't... Ugh, son of a gun. But yeah, a lot of people say I shouldn't get down on my abilities all the time. A lot of people think I am actually pretty good at Mario games, which... I mean, it, I wouldn't say it's because I'm good. I think it's just because I have a lot of experience playing Mario games, because... I mean, obviously I've been playing Mario games since, like, uh, 1991. I think that's when uh, Super Mario World came out. It was somewhere around there. But yeah, I've been playing video, ga or video games and Mario games specifically for like 20 years now, so... I admit I'm not the best. I just have a lot of experience and I'm going to die. Oh, come on! That was kind of unfair. Actually, it probably wasn't unfair at all. I just was in a very, very stupid place. Okay, um, we're getting close to the last star coin. And did I mention that I hate this part? <coughs> I actually don't think I did, but I'm going to go ahead and say it now. I hate this part. Ah, 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 get away from me, fish. Ah. What am I supposed to do? Oh, wait, that's what I'm supposed to do. I am an idiot, apparently. Okay. So yeah, there's a star coin right there. You can probably guess how we're supposed to do this. We gotta use Mr. Koopa here. It's gonna be a very, very weird maneuver, though. Aha! Oh, cool, I actually killed the fish, too. <laughs> I wasn't trying to do that, but... I'll take whatever I can get. And... oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. No, no. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Let me finish. Oh, that was close. I almost forgot that there was that giant line of Koopas right there. So I'm thankful that I had a hit right there. Otherwise, I was probably going to die there. Okay, let's move on to level 9-3. Um, I do not have very many items. I'll just use Mushroom. Usually I have a lot more fire flowers going into this point right here, but... Then again, I got very, very unlucky during the match game in this playthrough. Okay, so this level is the Bullet Bill level. For reasons you'll see at this moment. 
Uh, that bill, that bullet bill right there, I think it's called a bombshell bill, I think. It might have a different name in this game, but the premise is pretty much the same. Basically, they home in on you. I think the, uh, old bombshell bills, though, I think they, um... They didn't home in on you, but they, uh... Well, they did, but they didn't, like... They didn't change elevation. They were always at the same elevation, but they did follow you around, kind of. And I'm missing a lot of star coins, I can already tell. Because I'm kind of just skipping most of the level right here. Okay, there is a pipe right there, so I'm going to check that. I know there is definitely a star coin in here, but I don't know if it's the first one, or the second one, or the whatever one. I really don't know. Okay, so here we have a little uh, <coughs> P-switch puzzle. I don't remember how to do this. Um, I think we go from the bottom. I'm kind of looking for a route right here. I think I can see one. Okay, come on, get over here, all the way to the end. Fall down. Jump up here, and... Oh, come on. I'm not surprised, because I took a very long time to do that, but still. That's just... That's just annoying. <laughs> that's just really, really, really annoying. I'm already dealing with uh, waves and waves of bullet bills here. I don't need to be screwed by something stupid like that. Okay, where was the pipe? Is it right here? I can't tell. I honestly can't... Oh, wait, yeah, it is. Okay. Okay, let's try this again. Or do I have to do the whole level again? I have to do the whole level again. Oh, dang it. Well... I definitely went the right way. I was just way too slow in getting there. Oh, well, I'll continue. I'll come back later, I guess. Okay, where's the power-up? Not really the power-up I was looking for, but it'll do for now. Holy crap, we have giant bullet bills now. Bonsai bills. I think in the uh, Super Mario World cartoon show, they called them a... Uh, Magnum bills, but whatever. It's just a name, people. It's just a name. Okay, there is a star coin up there. That kind of sucks. I couldn't see where my feet were right there. No! Well, it looks like I'm going to go get that star coin regardless, so that's fine with me. I'll go ahead and get another mushroom, and... I've been recording for 13 minutes already? Where, where's my time limit? Okay, yep, 13 minutes. Oh, jeez. From the look of things, I might get through, like, half of the world in one video, half in the world in another video, and then I can post, like, the credits and stuff, so, I mean, that seems like a, like a pretty good plan to me. Oh, come on. You hit my shoe. You didn't hit Mario. You hit Mario's shoe. Okay, um... Actually... Okay, now I thought the star coin was right there, but I guess I was wrong. That seemed like a good place for it, though, because they had that arrow right there. Okay, there's that pipe again. Okay, let's try this a second time, and let's not screw it up. Is there actually a faster way that I just wasn't seeing? I guess I could go to the right, but I don't think that'll make that much of an extra difference. Actually, it might, but... I'll try it. What the hell? I have nothing to lose. Or actually, that's not true. I have everything to lose. Okay, there we go. Okay, that wasn't too bad. I just went the wrong way. The way I went originally also could have worked, but I guess in retrospect it's actually a bit slower. Something like that. I really don't know. Okay, give me a nice flower. Okay, here's Bonsai Bill time. 
I don't know if this coin right here is the second one or the third one. It honestly could be either, actually. Oh, jeez. Okay, yeah, that's the third one, so the second one's act. <laughs> okay, that was actually kind of hilarious, because I did nothing right there. Uh, Mario jumped on the Bonsai Bill, or the Bonsai Bill, like, made Mario land on him and then just knocked me off. Okay, that was kind of funny. Um, okay, I'm going to go ahead and uh, make some cuts right here. I'm going to go see if I can find that second star coin, too, so... I am going to use the propeller suit. It's my last one, but I really don't care. Because I need to look all over for that second star coin if I'm to find it. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, I just got the first star coin. I'm right here because I believe the second star coin is... Yep, right there. Okay, I, I kind of remembered where it was after thinking about it. And yeah, it's right here. I think. Maybe it's not. Maybe this is just a bonus room. Either way, it's, uh, here's something. Okay, there we go. That was actually kind of close. I cut that pretty close, I have to admit. But okay, we have all the star coins except this last one, but this last one's not gonna be much of an issue now that we have the propeller suit. And I believe the exit's, like, right up here. Come on, exit, where are you? Where are you? Okay, you're right here. Thankfully, you weren't too hard to find. And hooray, I get a one-up. And I get all my 1-ups back after the two I lost in this level. Alright, so now we're moving on to 9-4, which... Oh, God. I have to say, I like this level, but I freaking hate the last star coin. This last star coin is just very, very annoying. Because it requires you to keep a power-up till the very end of the stage. It's not the propeller mushroom, it's the power-up will get in this level. And it's really hard to keep, and it's really hard to use as well, at the point where you have to use it. I'm not going to go into much detail, because I'm sure we'll see it eventually, but... I'm just going to say, that for the record, that I really hate this star coin, or this level. Well, now again, I like the level, I just hate this last star coin, which is very, very annoying. It sucks. I believe this star coin took me the longest to get in my, during my live stream of this game. And like a lot of people would find that surprising because 9-7 is the actual hell level. But I don't know, this one just took me a lot longer to get. I don't know why, I just did. I think I easily played the level like, I don't know, 30 times. It's that annoying. For those of you who have never played this game, I'm just going to say it right now. It's very annoying. That's all I have to say about it. But yeah, if you couldn't tell, the main gimmick about this level, or one of the main gimmicks, is that there are bob -ombs. And you have to use the bob to get the star coin. Or, actually, no you don't. You, well, I, I think you have to use them for one of the star coins. You have to use the Ice Flower for the second star, or the last star coin. Like, yeah, here's the one where you have to use the bob -ombs. But this one's not as bad. Or maybe it is, I don't know. Oh wow, I actually got that. <laughs> okay, that was kind of insane, but I'll take it, I mean... <laughs> that was actually kind of funny, actually. Okay, is this the part where I need the Ice Flower? I hope it's not. Actually, I think it is. Yes, it is. Okay. I have to do this level again, but... I'm still kind of glad I got to this point, because... 
Actually, no, I'm not, because I died. Okay, I'll be right back, guys. Okay, here we are at this part again, and this time I actually have the ice flower this time, too. Okay. This part right here. Freaking hate this part. Okay. So, you see that piranha plant right there? Basically, in order to get the star coin, you have to freeze the piranha plant. So you can stand on it and then get into the red pipe. I've had to do this level a ridiculous amount of times just to get to this point, so... Whatever, I'm gonna go ahead and try to finish the level. Or actually, I can still try to get this now. It's not recommended, but... You know what? I really don't care, either. Oh, dang it! I went into the pipe without realizing it. Oh, dang it. But yeah, basically, that red pipe... That's what you have to do. You gotta get inside that red pipe. Which is ridiculously hard to do. I hate doing it. It's the worst part of this level. The second star coin is also a pain to get, just because of the angle you have to throw the bob on. But whatever, course clear, I'm gonna move on because... Honestly, I'm gonna be perfectly honest with you guys. That level took me about 15 minutes. At least. It was probably more like 25, but I, I really don't know. I don't really don't care. I'm gonna move on. So here we go to level 4-5. Or 9-5. 4-5? I'm an idiot. <laughs> 